y'all. Well, a lot of y'all that are friends of mine on Facebook know that I have this odd little animal that lives here with me. Her name is Tris, and she's, she's a, cat. a little kitty. Wow. And she's about two and a half years old, I'd say. And she came to live here from a friend's house. She never comes out. No. Joyce, so I've far as I know, seen her exactly one time. And in over a year. But she loves to play with these. Now, let's just talk briefly about cats. If you have a, a grandchild that has these little, you know, the little Those are the yogurt, yogurt things, things of the tops off the yogurts, cats love these because they skitter across the carpet real good. They can play ball with them. She loves that. These that orange, uh, she's all about that. But we're this afternoon in search of Tris. an elusive house cat. She she likes to be up underneath the ottoman. She tore the bottom off. She ottoman. tore the bottom off the ottoman, so she can't get up in the ottoman anymore. So she's more of under the bed kind of girl. And isn't there a book that was written some years back of the view from under the bed? Maybe so. I think that there's a book about cats and things. We'd love to hear your stories about your little odd little animals that live with you. They could be a dog, a cat, a ferret. Oh, I don't know. Pot Some people have got goats and little goat. We Pot have llamas pig. and oh, there's been a variety of things we know that our friends have. Yep. <laughs> so no telling what y'all got. <laughs> Give us a big old thumbs up on this video. Share it with a friend and subscribe so you'll know exactly when the next video comes out. Be sure to give us a thumbs up. Don't forget to survive. Don't forget to survive. <laughs>